Okay. All right. Let's get into this. Chapter 22. Oh, you know what I didn't do? I mean, not that we're really using any of the new recruits. Um, I forgot to look up the recruitment. Recruitment. That's not what I want. Is this it? Yes. I am a filthy little cheater when it comes to that. We're at uh, 21. Um, or 20. We're going to about to start 22. Okay. Sorry, I'm just like orienting myself. I probably should have done this before uh, I went live, but here we are. Okay. Um, we didn't do any of the support conversations or anything beforehand, so let's uh, let's get that done. Speak to the youth. Hey, Ike or General Ike, wait up. Say, if there's an enemy in my way, but I don't want to kill him, what do you think I should do? Is this about that stupid game again? Well, it's all your fault. You had to go and tutor Daniel, and now I've been stuck in a losing streak. Tutor? You mean back when we were just on board the ship? It was just one hit, one hint. Daniel isn't like me. He's smart. <laughs> George. I'm the one who thought up this game, but he's the only one who's getting better and better. I hardly ever win anymore. Instead of playing the game, why don't you try some real combat? Stop joking around. We're happy-go-lucky traveling merchants. We don't know anything about fighting. Give me a break. It's nice you're having fun and all, but please. Can you save your stupid game for someone who's uh, not fighting for their life day in, day out? Well, what do you expect? Everything's war, war, war. And there's no place for us. All we can do is play this game. Sorry, I'll just go lose again, I guess. Oh, for heaven's sake. Getting meta? Yeah. For sure. Look, if there's an opponent you don't want to kill, just shove him out of the way. Then you don't have to fight him. Huh. Thanks. Uh, you know, we are what we are, but we'll be with you till the end. I hope we can contribute, uh, continue to be of service, all right? Yeah, thanks. Sorry to be so irritable. That's all right. I know how much stress you've been under. What's up, Eric, Eric, by the way? Good to see you again. Talk to Sooth. Something on your mind? Oh, Commander Ike. Uh, I guess I'm supposed to call you General now? Commander's fine. What's going on? Thinking about the person you were looking for? That's all settled, actually. No, it's not really getting settled. It's not really yet settled. It's just, I figured that worrying about it all the time wasn't doing me any good. I turned over every rock and big neon looking uh, during my search, but it's just easier to assume that everything is going well somewhere. Well, as long as you're you're happy, I won't say a word. What were you thinking about then? I didn't say anything before, but Dayan is my homeland. Is that so? Yeah, until a few years back, I lived in the slums of Nevassa and stole for a living. So anyway, I went back to my old stomping grounds. I saw some friends. The rest of the city's empty, but they're still there. They got no other place to go, you know? And what they have to say? Everyone was mad that Cry Crimea's run had won. They said that if the king had been there, there's no way they would have been defeated. It's so weird. Until now, all they'd ever done is complain about this place. I see. You know, Ashtar wasn't such a bad king. At least, as far as we could see. If you were strong enough, you could rise up and become a knight one day. You could escape the slums. He was the only king who ever gave us that chance, that hope. Don't get me wrong. I don't mind fighting with all of you. But still, seeing your homeland scarred and trampled like this is tough. I'm sorry, I know Crimea is suffering in the same way, but I can't change how I feel. <laughs> Thanks, Eric. Uh, yeah, I got a little, got a haircut. Uh, it was getting unruly. <laughs> So, it was time. 
Uh, we don't have any support stuff, do we? No. This is never, never lit. Oh wait, race and Kieran do. Oh, it is lit. I, I guess we'll speak to Race. Ah, Kieran, here you are. Oh, hey, Race. What brings you here? May watch you train. I figured someone with a heel staff should be around just in case an accident happens. <laughs> you worry, wart. But being watched is good. Now I can take my training to the next level. All right, watch this. No, oh, er. I'm just here to see that you don't get hurt. Do be careful. No, don't juggle the lance, too. Behold the awesome power of the Crimean Royal Knight, 5th Platoon Captain Kieran. Now I call this little trick. <laughs> Nuts! Oh dear heavens, this is terrible. Just casually training in the day in throne room. I mean, we live here now. Stay right there, let me take care of you. Oh, I'm fine, don't worry about old Kieran. Just need to pull this axe out of my head. Oh boy, that's sharp. Just a just a bonding moment between between good buds. Okay, let's manage. Let's award some XP. Um, Ike doesn't need anything. I was actually thinking about um, like we could we could level up, continue to level up Rolf. I don't think we necessarily need to Rolf and Mist. I feel like they're they're good. I was thinking about, is Falcon Knight a promoted class? I'm gonna look it up. Promoted, one of the promoted forms of Pegasus Knight. Okay, so I was worried that, uh, Tanith uh, was not promoted, but apparently she is. Yeah, yeah, she's promoted already. Um, yeah, I'm like, I don't know who to award XP to. Like, I guess some characters we're not using that we, we could use if we wanted to. But I don't know. It's fine. We did manage to um, steal a bunch of stuff. Uh, okay, we need to um, we have like a ton of gold, so um, we're just gonna put some steel swords on Ike. Um, I know the micromanaging bit isn't necessarily super fun, but we gotta get it done. Astrid needs an actual bow. Like, not a junk bow. Oh wait, we should be... I wonder if we could... Is there stuff in the convoy? We should probably check this first. A Lejeune's bow. That's not what I want. We could actually... Like, I don't, I don't know if we necessarily need that killer bow. We just need... Oh, you can buy long bows. Excellent. That is excellent. Uh, we'll just put an iron bow on her. As much as I would love to put a longbow on her, eh, maybe we should. I was gonna give one to Rolf. Uh, Tennis, good to go. Boyd's good to go. Maybe we can um, let's give the longbow. Let's give the. What is this doing? Second movement as with cavalry. 
Um... Volk has all of the all of the stuff. He's got all of the stuff. Why do I even check? Energy drop. I guess we could start leveling up Soren. He, like, kind of needs it. He's still at 17. To be useful, we gotta level him up. Okay, let's buy um, Rolf Longbow. Uh, what? Armory? There we go. Got there. Let's take that longbow that has two more shots on it and just give it to Astrid. She can't even use it. Is she not good enough with a bow? I mean, I guess, I guess not. She's an A with the bow. Is that, I guess that's not good enough? Bo D. That's very weird. I don't know, we'll leave it on her. I, I don't know, maybe we'll get to use it. I don't know what the deal is with that. We did have some other people who needed stuff. Who was it? Kieran. Yeah, Kieran's using a hand axe. Let's see if we've got... All we have is, like, fucking... All these, like, weird axes. Um, we can give him, like, a legit axe. We can forge. Let's forge. Although, we probably should give him, like, a regular axe as well. Start with silver. Yes. Crit goes up to nine. We don't need that. Uh, yeah, let's do it. my axe. Make it purple. There we go. Give it to Kieran. Yes. Uh, let's uh, convoy give the pole axe. And let's just buy an axe for him to hold on to. I don't even know. He doesn't even need the hand axe. He has the bow. What am I doing? Let's get rid of that. We'll take this uh, pole axe and uh, we will shop armory, throw a steel axe on there. I mean, we could get a silver axe, but I don't know. We're just going to be using it to hit idiots, like dudes in our way. 35. Uh, durability seems more important than hitting them a little extra harder. Um, okay. Everybody's outfitted. Uh, let's... What if we just... What if we just...
What if we just like... I mean... Mounted archers can't use the longbow. That's wild. But like, what if we just... Because that would be broken. <laughs> well, yeah, alright. Look at those new fancy robes. Mm. Excellent. I love the higher movement. A new specialization. It's got to be staff, right? Knife seems like it sucks. I. It's got to be staff. Okay, so we have... We have some stuff that we got. Soul and Luna consecutively. Yeah, because I know what those are. Doubles the effect of shove. Uh, corrosion. In certain, uh, causes enemies to drop durability. That seems like it sucks. Nullifies an enemy attack. Okay. Let's. What is what does Oscar have assigned? Lethal blows to half damage. That seems weird. Jill doesn't have anything. Let's put something. Parody's great for selling. Yeah. Uh. Counter? Maybe? Guard? Let's just put guard on her. I want to keep her alive. <laughs> it was Tan Tanth has reinforced. That makes a lot of sense. Yeah, all these seem bad. Shade. Enemies to attack other units first. Oh yeah, I, for I forgot about that. Insight. Hit percentage. Resolve. Uh, whenever units half half HP, he goes into like a resolve mode. Canto blessing. Adapt. Two consecutive attacks. Okay. Yeah. Um. These are all bad except for smite and guard. <laughs> Yeah. Seems like that. Seems like that. I mean, we could... We don't have Smite. For a second there, I was like, we got an S1. It's it's stun. We don't have stun. Occult... This is... Oh, this is our occult scroll that we still haven't used. Okay, we're gonna say. Whoa, 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 we gotta do one more thing. One more thing. Do we have a uh, staff here? None that Soren can use. All right. All right, I think we're good. Save it. Roll the saves.
So you're going to lead a small unit out on a survey mission? Oh, this is the dude who wants to take credit for everything that we've done? Yeah, that's the plan. However, though we've taken the castle, there are still pockets of day in resistance. It's possible they might mount an attack and retake the palace. I want you to be in charge of the watch. This level's a pain? We'll see. That is, of course, not a problem. However, you're taking the princess along. Do you think it'd be safer to uh, take more troops? Even if we split our battalion, we'll have enough men to handle both tasks. I'm just not used to moving around with such a large group. For this mission, I'd like to keep uh, the, peop the number of people involved as low as possible. It's not that I don't understand how you feel, but we will compromise. You know, for someone from Big Nian, you're pretty flexible. It speeds things up considerably. To be a soldier, must quickly adapt to circumstances around him. All right, we'll be back. Take care. This is the palace Nasser mentioned. Palmini Temple. I hope whatever he's trying to tell me will come will become clear once we get inside and look around. Oh right, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what's going on now. I still can't believe Nasser was on day inside. I just can't. And though he let the and he let the dragon girl get away. Although I'm sure he had his reasons for that as well. I wonder, was it really Nasser? Although besides my family, the only people who showed them a da the only people I showed the medallion to were Titiana, Princess Alencia, and Nasser. I thought I could trust him. I really did. Why did he do it? Missed. Thinking about the past isn't going to help. Let's take a look at this temple. What did you say? The Crimean army is here? They want to investigate the temple. What should I tell them? Crud, this ain't good. I don't know what they're after, but if they find us mercenaries who sided with Dan, they'll wipe us out. It's all the will of the goddess. Resign yourself to your fate. Accept it. Bat dumb. No one's gonna roll over and die. Dying's for sissies. Slow. So tell me, how many are there? There appears to be about ten, including the women. God, that's good news. It is? I had to turn it down in my headphones a little. This, like, beat there is just loud. If that's a lot of them, we can take care of our own. It'll be like stealing, uh, stealing a baby from the cradle. Yeah, bat dog. The translators had fun with that one. Right then, here's the plan. Pretend like you want to help them, lead them inside, and then listen good. You best not whisper a word of us being here, or else... But I couldn't. What you ask is beyond. Don't forget, we've got all the other priests under our control. Unless you want to meet the goddess early, do as you're told. Oh dear. Let's go. Alright. We'd like to take a look around. Please show us each room. Uh, very well. Th this is um, a very large room. Um, are you alright? Why are you shaking like that? Oh, goddess, please forgive me. It's a trap! Look at this guy. Har, gahar, har har har. You did it. Please forgive me. Thought something like this might happen. I don't know how you got wind of us. Showing up in such a small group means you're out of luck. None of you are getting out of here alive. We just fought our way to the dang capital. You're not even going to slow us down. Cocky, ain't you? But who said this was going to be a fair fight? Eh? What, what are you doing? Hey, bring the others. Oh my god, all of the boys. You fools are gonna be our shields. What? Gar har 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 har. Gahar har har. Gahar har har har. See, you ain't so useless after all. You filthy dogs. These are innocent people. You can't. 
no mercy. Please help me. Hey, if you want them purdy robes of yours turned red, you'll attack these scum. If you ever think about betraying us, I'll kill every one of you. But you can't. Crimeans, please forgive us. We cannot allow our brothers to die. Alright, so this is what the the youth was telling us beforehand. This cowardice will not stand. These priests are being made to fight against their will. We gotta try and save as many of them as possible. Let's go. Okay, let's choose units. Um, Ike Oscar in the mix. Um, Mist, I guess. Kieran, Astrid, Jill, Boyd. Uh, we pull Reese and Volk? For Soren. Maybe go in with that crew. Still seems like it seems like so many so many dudes. This was you want as many as units that can shove? I figured. I figured this is what what because the youth was telling us, you know, push them out of the way. Um, so that you can attack. Your mounted units can't shove. Oh, so, like... <laughs> uh, we're gonna keep Oscar. Yeah, we don't want to summon the cavalry, the reinforcements, so... All these, all these other ones are bad, though. These are all, these are all my bad, my bad ones. I mean, I guess we'll take... Um... Gotri, Shinon, Zyhark. Let's not take Zyhark. I just noticed he was only 15. Stefan. Devdan. Racing. Racing dance. Racing. Racing. Oh, yeah. Getting a second turn when you're trying to push people around probably seems like a really good idea. Okay, let's reposition. Okay, racing. Get in the back. Shin's got an iron bow. That doesn't seem great. Just a heavy spear. We gotta outfit some of these guys. Um, it seems like uh, uh, Rolf and uh, like range characters are gonna be like hammering people too, right? Like. Being able to shoot over somebody is going to be really good. Um, we can't get to the convoy from here. We have to go back. Let's go back. What a pain. Uh, outfit. I guess we'll... Um, Shop. Gotri's all all good to go. Shinon's fine. Enemies can pass through priests. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't let that stupid uh, trick they don't tell you. I assume because they're, you know, uh, units that are... Is this... Is, is a spear a lance? Yes. 
especially effective against Jonas Knights. Let's give Dev Dan a uh, regular. Oh. This, this feels like it's going to be a shit show, by the way. Maybe we keep Astrid, Longbow, or not the Longbow, but we can, we can uh, give the Longbow back to the convoy. Does Shinon, Shinon have a... Yeah, Shinon's got a Longbow. Rolf's all... We'll give Shinon the other longbow. Um, yeah, this seems like it's going to be a shit show. Let's save it. Okay, let's uh, look at the board real quick. Treasure chests. That means I have to take a thief with me. <laughs> Treasure chests on both sides. Uh, we do have uh, Oscar on the horse, so he can transport the thief pretty well. Um, We gotta cut one person. Cut Gotri, maybe? He seems slow. Deb Dan for Volk. Gotri seems slow, though, you know? But I guess he can push pretty well because he's heavy. Pretty middling. Yeah. Alright. Well, I'll, I'll roll with your suggestion, Eric. Eric. Let's um, reposition. I kind of don't know... Like... Okay, we're just gonna find out. Let's save it and, and get in there. We may have to... We, there may be a reset in our future. Gotri's a good unit for Smite. Well, if we lose this, we'll keep that in mind. <laughs> Careful of the promoted priest. That's what I was wondering. Because they gotta have magic, right? Or offensive magic. Man, a lot of them... Oh yeah, Bishop has silence. A lot of them don't even have any heal or anything. They're just, like, unequipped, huh? Yeah, silence... That's a mage, not a priest. There's another one here. Light. Yeah, yeah. This guy's this guy's gonna be a problem. I think can is that guy on the recruitment list? Uh no. Okay. That screen is bright. They will attack and your units will kill him on the crackback? Yeah, yeah. We're going to try to not have our units kill them on the crackback. This is armored side, apparently.
I don't think this is what I wanted, but all right, it's fine. In my mind, I was attacking this guy, but that didn't didn't work out that way, huh? Kill that thief? Yeah, that's what I'm trying to do. Cause I don't want him opening chests. Is there any? Is there a thief on this side? Doesn't look like it. Man, these guys are kind of tough, huh? Well, never mind. If we'd split the groups, this middle area, this guy won't be able to do anything. I mean, I could just run up with just Ike. We could do just Ike in the middle. <laughs> What's up, Bernardo? Uh, maybe just Ike in the middle? That seems reckless and terrible, but just might work. That's not gonna work. Hit is 59. What? I'm trying to figure out what I want to do here. I suppose we could just. Nope, that's not gonna work. That might work. Twenty-nine percent crit. That's what we're going for. Oh, this will just work. Rolf's gun just works. Cold dead eyes of a killer. We're just gonna give this one a shot. If he whiffs on, on one of the hits, then uh we'll send in we'll send in somebody. Oh he'll just miss twice. That's what'll happen. Killing me. Killing me. Rayson, we can't reach. This guy can move through and try to kill Rayson, so we're not we are not gonna put him in harm's way. But we will put him all the way over here. I think he he'll be fine there. Steel sword. Yeah, I think he'll be fine there. Yeah. All right, and then we'll we'll I guess not block our way. I've played a Zelda puzzle before. Will Shinon die on this map? That's the real question. Oh no, now we can't push that guy. Oh my god, I already want to restart. It seems critical that we get that thief. I'm gonna restart. It seems 
real critical. R extremely critical that we get that thief. We're gonna reposition. Uh, race him a little closer. Yeah, restart incoming. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, you know what? Instead of Shinon, even though Shinon can push, we're gonna put Astrid in. She's just a better archer. Maybe we'll put armor on both sides. Yeah, maybe this is what it looks like. Let's save it. And then let's make it a priority to get that thief. Or at least block the entrance. Let's just handle it. Hashtag handle it. Just fix things. Let's just fix things. <laughs> Astrid is an actual monster. Okay, so Raisin will heal or or give somebody a second a second round to whoever's around him. So we should probably move like we should probably keep that in mind. We're gonna put him here. Right? Yeah, we're gonna put him here. So we want like Rolf here to to do an attack. Rolf's a, a maniac, an actual human maniac. And then let's put, uh, who is this, Zyhark? Stefan. Uh, we'll put Stefan there and then we'll just... Oh, we can't chant everybody. I thought we could chant everybody. All right, let's just chant the armor. Roll Thal Ghoul does it again. Yeah. Okay, here's here's my worry. So we're gonna have the armor try to attack the mage, which is not a good matchup. But it's what I did. So we're just gonna. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, do we have to restart already? <laughs> okay, alright, this time's a charm. Only when Rayson is transformed does he do everybody around him. Yeah, I need I need Divine Pulse real bad. <laughs> okay, alright, alright. get in there. Okay, this time. Third time's, third time's the charm. didn't even do it. Rolf's bow. 
Yeah, that'll do it. I just got lucky. Because Rolf's a stone cold killer. Okay. Here's my problem, right? Like, I want to put a character here. But also, this guy's got to die. Because otherwise, he'll kill the armor. So, like, ideally, we do want the armor here. But... Like, I need to move... Like, I'm, I'm worried that if we put Stefan in the middle here, these two guys... This guy and this guy will kill him. But I guess we'll just roll the dice, find out. Can Stefan even kill the... The mage? I guess we'll roll the dice and find out. Oh, yeah, he's fine. He might take a hit, though, which is not great, but... No, he won't. He's good. He's all good. Everything's good. Okay. Now we just hope that we don't get rolled over by those two guys. Okay, let's do the... let's do this side now. Soren in the mix. Just as I planned, yes. Exactly. Not leaving nothing to chance. <laughs> leaving more than a few things to chance. That doesn't kill him. Shit. Shit. This is bad. This is real bad. Do we need to... We need to put him here. Wait, he did... Oscar did this before. Like, Oscar did... Killed this guy. He criticaled off that 8% chance. Do we just start killing priests? Like, is that is that where we're at right now? I'm starting to feel that way. Like, what if we just wholesale slaughtered this board? Any moral objections? I think, okay, I think, oh, we're gonna put, uh, racing over here. You wanna get the bonus prize? All right, we're gonna put Volk over here because we're gonna clear this out in like a second. Um, So I think if we hurt him hard, if we hit him hard enough, I think he'll retreat for healing. 
Although there are all the priests are down here, they're not up here. So maybe he won't retreat? I don't know. We're just gonna try it. I'm just gonna try it. 8%, 8%, come on, come on. Didn't happen. Yeah, if it's worth the time to get the bonus. Uh, we're gonna block Soren from uh, being attacked. Oh, buddy. I didn't have to worry about you at all, apparently. Should we have been using Stefan this whole time? Oh my god. Oh my... <laughs> Stefan just like, I, I got this completely on lock. Don't worry about me. Seems good. Once again, Astrid holding everything together. Uh, they're over here. I don't even think we need. There's like one other guy. There's a hallway in here, so I assume reinforcements eventually. There's also one over here. It could get bad. He did make a quip about how, uh, we don't have, like, okay. He made a quip about how he's got huge numbers of dudes. Maybe we should roll. I don't think we need this many people in here. I'm kind of wondering if we should just roll the rest of these up the middle. I'm not sure. Man, this board is breaking my brain. All right, we're gonna... Get our thief in there. Pop bottles. Let's go. Try to guard the bird bird guy. Okay. What's that? That's not the button. What? There we go. Snap to the next guy. Please. Alright. These guys are all just... They're all just up in here. Huh? We're, I'm gonna cross, cross over Calvary here. Because he doesn't push and we need somebody to push. Getting it done. Uh, 
Uh, should we leave somebody back here with Soren just in case? They won't reinforce this fast. Oh, buddy. We're using a lot of units that we don't normally use, which is kind of great. I don't think we changed Dyke Sword. Oh wait, we did. We did. He's a, he's got an iron sword, right? Oh, he got a chest key. How nice. Oh, reinforcements, as I predicted. Not great. Not a great look. Not a lot of room to move around. Just uh, put Rolf in there, I guess. Or, or, Stefan just gets it done. Do we, even, do we even have a healer on this side? I don't think we do. I'm putting, I'm putting Stefan in, in harm's, in harm's way. This is a feral one, whatever that means, and a Lagoo's Slayer. I mean, we could... Just steal ants. Move him here. Just now, now they can't uh, get in there. And we'll just chip away. We'll just get them. Um, I don't know that we need Rayson over here or Rolf anymore. But, I mean, we could just, I don't know, chant it up again. Do we have any range? There's nobody's ranged over here. No. I'm, I'm worried about getting shot through the pillow, but I guess that's not. That's an unfounded worry. We're getting there. We're getting there. Got a chest key. Oh, hello. Don't mind if I do. Oh, well, I guess I could just... We could just wait. I mean, we could move, I guess. Yeah, you know what? Uh, it's gonna be fine. They'll both, they'll both try to attack uh, Oscar. Oscar's got plenty of hit points. Maybe it's fine. Whoa, can I reach? Oh, it's just, it's just... Trying to shoot more priests. Somebody picked up a chest key that was Ike. We're gonna use Ike in battle though. Come on, boy. 
funny. Okay, so this guy's got poor movement now. He's got a bow, too. I mean, he's not gonna kill Boyd. 26? Right? That's something you say before Boyd dies, right? I mean, let's just... let's just be careful. Let's just be careful. There's no need to rush. Can I not move him? Oh, that's a soldier. Oh, that's a bad guy. I did not... Mm, I thought that was our thief for some reason. Whatever, we got him, we got him. It's fine. <laughs> I thought I was like, I'm gonna open all these chests with the thief. But, uh, yeah. Who do we have left? Oh, just our thief. We can't get anywhere. A lot, of, a lot of dramatic pomp and circumstance around that miss. Ooh, Gotri, not having a great time. Excellent. I forgot that, uh, the Heron King does that. Five times two. That doesn't seem great. That seems better. Fifty nine percent chance to hit eighty four. Okay. But if we miss, we're dead. <laughs> like, should we just... Like, it sucks, but we should probably just keep, you know, our guys alive. Shove him left and then shove him right. I mean, we. I guess we could do that, or we could just walk him around, and then I'm gonna put Gotri on one of these spaces.
just in case more dudes pop out of them. I don't know. Seems silly, but whatever. Oh, that's bad. Unless... Are you fucking kidding me, dude? Thief coming in here, like, at the 11th hour. I'm gonna murder that guy. Bruh. My dude. Get out of here. Spirit dust. Ooh, I have no idea what that is. Let's uh pick up the boy and then uh, get him over to the other side. Yeah, right? Volk nearly shocked to death. The, the critical thing is nearly. I totally forgot that that dude does that. There's so much going on on this board. Look at... Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me with the range? Is he gonna kill Ryson? Like, that doesn't seem right. That doesn't seem fair and just. How much movement do you have? Eight? I mean, is he gonna kill... Now I'm like, is he gonna kill... Gotri? Because Gotri's not strong against magic. Maybe we should have killed that guy. You know what? Silence. Great. Oh, thank God. More guys. That's the exact thing I didn't want. Another feral one. Well, extremely suspicious of these, like, guys might come out of these holes. I'm suspicious of the guy holes, is what I'm saying.
Should we have been using Stefan this entire time? Maybe. I did pull him out of the desert for no reason. <laughs> he does it with a headbutt. probably don't want to put him in the line of fire, if possible. How much movement... Uh, next to unit. Where's our assassin? There we go. Seven. Movement seven. If we get here... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven... We're gonna take two turns to get in there anyway. I mean, we could drop him. He'll be fine. We probably don't wanna leave him alone, too, if these boy holes are, are any indication. These holes full of, full of boys. Okay, Ike, can we just take care of this? Is that enough? Is that too much? That's 38, isn't it? Damn it. <laughs> Wait, is it 38? Hold on. Yeah, it's 38. Damn it. I mean, we could just go for it. He's only got a 10% chance to hit. We could also just change to the steel sword. Yes, that seems good. guys in here I the thing is is like I don't know where they're gonna cut I, I fear that they will come out of this this place uh, but maybe we should put some people in here with Volk oh buddy oh I love this I love this Ike is going to handle the entire middle by himself. That's the plan. Unless this goes wrong. Didn't go wrong. Remember when they were excited we didn't bring a lot of guys? Well, turns out we didn't need a lot of guys. We needed a single guy. Can Rolf get up there? He can't get up there. Am I going to regret this? Only time will tell. Yeah, that's not great for Rolf. All right, let's start opening chests. If we bumped him... Give him a little nudge. Get in there, buddy. Oh wait, is he going to get shocked to death? 
Is that a thing? Volk, don't die. Like, be cool, Volk, for like once. For once. seems totally fine. Get rid of this boltling up here. Oh, I got the boltling. That's great. Send it to the convoy. Yes. It's only a boltling one, which is kind of a bummer. Let's just box in this archer so we can't do anything. Oh, wait. We can't box him in because they'll walk through the priests. Okay. Covering up the holes. I don't know if that's a thing that works, but it's a thing we're gonna do. Might as well chant. Okay. I feel like we're we're on the upswing now. Hopefully. We're gonna leave them in there for now. Oscar getting all the play right now. I feel like he's gonna his bow's gonna break. That's a bit of a bummer. How's his bow? 13, he's fine. Ike and Oscar can really just run this game, huh? Like, it, it's total possible. It's a total possibility to just do Ike runs in this. gonna ignore the rest of the team at this point. This Merc.
<laughs> I was hoping we could cover that up. And then the boys just spilled out anyway. <laughs> Shit. This is a real bad situation over here. Oh, man. Can't hit. Mm. I want to hit the feral one in the corner. But I guess we're not going to do that. Uh, we could pin the feral one in, like, like so, this one on the right side. I mean, if we, if we kill the guy though, then we, they're not pin they're no longer pinned in. So, I don't know. So where he decides to slaughter innocent civilians. Yeah, we gotta make this go quicker. Fire hits for 20. I mean, we'll pop it off. Why not? Uh, ooh, that was really good. Um, if we move Soren here, oh, if we move Soren here, or uh, Volk here, it cuts Soren off except for one person who knows magic. Um, I'm worried about Soren being left alive, but I might need to start worrying about Volk being left alive. Maybe anybody being left alive? Who do you think, who do you think's, uh, better equipped to deal with, uh, this feral one? Void? Or, or our new guy here? Defense 22, defense 13, probably our new guy. Yeah, he only hits back for five. Is promoted and at a higher level. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He just has a higher raw defense, too. Like, he'll be fine in there. Boxing that dude in. The real question is... Can Volk murder this dude? He totally can. That's excellent news. Last hire, first fired. Look, when you come to work for the Grail Mercenaries... Let's just let's just say uh, <laughs> if you're gonna if you're gonna if you're gonna go down for last hired first murdered is is what they say. So now do we have to worry about? I I should just start moving these guys over here. Should I just? If we just move to one side, maybe then then I don't have to worry about being like. rolled up on, on multiple fronts.
All right, let's deal with these idiots. Guy still th still thinks he's got it. Still thinks he's got a chance. Okay. All right. Iron sword doesn't do it, steel sword does. Heckin' murdered. Can we just uh, pick off one of these idiots? Eh, not really. Can we just pick off this idiot? Game's over then, right? No, we definitely cannot do that. Those two priests attacked me at the top. Oh, these guys. Yeah. Yeah, I don't want to push too hard. I want to keep Ike and Oscar next to each other so they have a high dodge. Uh, who else do we got? Just, just these guys? Go ahead and hit. I think I underestimate using uh, Racing. I probably should use him more. The fact he heals everybody as well is like just really useful. Just a really great utility character. Um, should we just knock this dude aside and then just uh, hit him with uh, mounted? It's not great. I think we're wrapping this one up. I do not do these maps in a timely fashion, by the way. This is an hour and a half to wrap up this map. Uh, do we need anybody else? No. Tell me, how many pathetic priests do you have to kill to get here? None. Come on, five? More? They're pretty scrawny. Probably take like ten without breaking a sweat. Cowardly cur. Time to start hiding and fight like a man. Oh no! The counterattack!
Whatever, it's fine. Let's just roll with it. Yeah, you told me. You did. You did. I... Yeah. The other one, the blood of the innocents. Come on. Come on. Come on. They're not that innocent, first of all. First of all. It's one innocent dude among hundreds. How many were killed in the flood, is all I'm saying. Hey, robes. If I get so much scratched, you better head into healing. It's how many priests do you have to kill to get to me? And I'm like, zero. But that one's gonna die in a second. <laughs> Oh, this is a huge pain in the ass. Do I have to bring Rolf in here? Never mind. I don't need to bring Rolf in here. Gwar har ha should have brought more priests or some babies. Dang. He'd be unstoppable if he just taped all the priests to himself. Never be able to get to him. Fucking war criminal. Feel good about killing that guy. Thank you very much. I never imagined we'd be rescued by soldiers of an enemy nation. I'm really, really bummed, by the way, that we did not... One priest. A single priest. I should have switched to the lance. Ah. What a bummer. But, we're moving on. There was no way we'd cut down innocent priests being forced to fight against their wills. And yet, we were not able to save everyone. Ugh. Peace, my lord. We were expecting... We were expecting to be killed at once, and yet you rescued so many of us. Father, we bear no ill will towards the kingdom of Dayan itself. We wish only to reclaim the homeland which was unjustly taken from us. That's the reason we fight. We had no desire to invade this land. If nothing else, please believe that. I beg your pardon. May I favor for your, of your name? Alincia Riddell Crimea. I'm the sole survivor of the Crimean royal family. Oh. You... Let us give thanks that you are alive and well. And please, uh, beg your understanding as well. There are many Danes who do not support the king's actions. I understand. Now it's time to search this place. My lord Ike, may I join you? Sure, why not? Everyone's lending a... Uh... Ike! Ike, where are you? Mist, I'm over here. Are you invisible now? Oh no, she's not invisible. Ike, this way, quickly! Rayson's in trouble. What? Rayson, what is it? He's been like this from the moment he set foot in this room. He's just staring at the walls. One of the good day -ins. Come on. They're just people. The only... There's a couple bad day -ins, but mostly they're all good day -ins. Okay, there's more than a couple bad day -ins. What is all this? Every wall has the same pattern on it. It's not a pattern, it's an ancient language. All chants and spells in the magic scrolls are written thusly. Can you read it, Sorn? 
Some, but not all. The anti-war dance, yeah. Some, but not all. Spells are simple. Uh, whereas this is a complex narrative. I think Prince Rayson could read it. I believe this is the same language that Leanne was speaking. It is. The Serene's language. Their chants are all in this language, too. So Rayson's reading what's written on the walls? It appears that way. Shall we leave him be? There's a lot of writing here. Could take hours. I think it's a good idea. Ike. From what I can gather, I think a person was locked in this room sometime in the past. You don't know who it was, do you? I was able to read enough of the writing, but I found this under the bed. It is? I think it may have belonged to the person who was imprisoned in the room. I apologize. I took up too much of your time. Rayson, you don't look good. Why don't you rest for a bit? No, I'm fine. It's more important we talk. About the owner of this feather? Was that in the room? Soren found it. Whose was it? Lila. My older sister. Lila? It's gotta be Lila, right? Lilia? Lilia. My older sister. The writing on the walls is hers. Do you have an older sister, too? Will you tell us about it? She was kidnapped 20 years ago, the night of the Serene's massacre. I thought that Lilia had been murdered along with uh, my older brothers and sisters. I believed that until today. Who took her? The walls say only it was a large human. She probably never knew who it was. He thrust a clan treasure at her and demanded that she use her magic to revive the thing sealed inside it. He extorted her again and again, but to no avail, Lil Lilia refused her the request every time, because she did not possess that power. Someone wanted to revive the Dark God. Shortly after she was brought here, Lilia fell ill and collapsed. I'm not surprised, it was a terrible time. She was imprisoned in that tiny room with no view of the earth or sky. Oh, that's awful. Missed. I'm sorry, I just feel so sad for her, and for Rayson, too. I beg your pardon, let me continue. A young Bjork began coming into the room to care for her. She had bluish hair and blue eyes. And her heart was unusually pure for a Bjork. This time, Lilia came, uh, in time, Lilia and she became to be friends and shared a mutual trust. That's gotta be their parents, right? Mist and Ike's parent, mom? Lilia decided to entrust her, uh, her hopes to the woman. They shared no common language, so it took some time. But eventually the Bjork woman understood what Lilia wanted, which was to take the treasure and, and the song and flee this temple. Brother. Was there anything else written about the Bjork woman? A name, perhaps. Translated in our language, it probably means Elena. I knew it. Mother. It was our mother. What? Are you sure? Our mother's name was Elena. Uh, like me, her hair was blue, as were her eyes. Rayson, the object you referred to your clan treasure was an aged brown medallion, wasn't it? How do you know that? The medallion became my mother's keepsake. The song, too, my parents both gave their lives to protect it. Mike, you and Miss Arlena's children? Then Loren's medallion is here? Um, the medallion was stolen, probably by Diane. I can't. This is unbelievable. Can a thing like this be chance? To be honest, I don't fully understand all that's happened. But it all makes sense. It all comes together. Ah. That's the song, but the melody's a little different, isn't it? It's similar to the song Rayson and Leanne sang in the forest. My mother used to sing it as a lullaby. I wanted to up the volume there, just to get a little bit of the lullaby on stream. It's a song of release, the one Lilia entrusted to Elena. But I wore the medallion and sang that song almost every night, and nothing happened. 
The magical effect of the song is awakened by the power of the singer. It can't be unleashed by anyone. The true song release can only be sung by a girl named Altina. Lilia wanted your mother to take the melody to Altina and return the medallion to its rightful place in Serene's forest. The story's becoming clearer and clearer. My father fled Dane to protect my mother, who was carrying the amulet. Like, how did you know? Volk told me. He told me about my father's past and the amulet too, and the dark god. So you know everything. King Ashnar took Lilia, didn't he? That would be the final piece of the puzzle. After all, the man who found my father was the king's henchman. Like are you saying, you know who killed Commander Grail? You never said anything about that. You thought his murder was unknown. Why didn't you say anything? I don't know. I just never felt like talking about it. He was a Dane soldier. Who was he? Who was the man who killed Commander Grail? Ike, tell me! Can we discuss this later? Yes, uh, yeah, of course. Up to this point, we've all been fighting for the liberation of Crimea. Even if we now add to that stopping the Dark God from being released and punishing Commander Grail's killer, our enemy remains unchanged. King Dan and his henchmen are the ones we must defeat. It's mysterious, isn't it? I mean, Grayson said the same thing earlier, but could all this really be mere coincidence? The fall of Crimea, Ike's parents, the death of Rayson's sister, the fact that everything leads back to Dane. If true, it ch changes the meaning behind this war. The treatment of Lilia is one thing, but the assassination of the former apostle, the framing of the destruction of my nation. If it was all part of Dane's plan to seal the medallion, to steal the medallion and the song, then I, the reason I fight. We are neck deep in it. If that's the decision you've reached, we'll, res we'll respectfully comply. If we can march quickly and know that someone's protecting our backs, it would be a huge relief. As you wish, may the fortunes of war be with the Crimean army. If you have need of soldiers, send word. I'll move at top speed. I'll be counting on it. All right, so the battalion's going to be moving behind us, I guess. The information ga gathered at Palmini Temple leads Ike ever closer to the hidden truths behind war. I feel like this is a Star Wars crawl right now. The assassin of Bagnion's former apostle led to the massacre of Serenians. And all it took was the death of one instant priest. That one guy... Look, if he didn't want to die, he shouldn't have lashed out, is all I'm saying. Oh my god, these horns. No chill. No chill on these horns. Serene's princess was, was kidnapped. Medallion is stolen. A complex... A complex scheme? Seemed to con connect these events. And now the threads have become clearer and clearer. Ashnard's motives are still a mystery, but a silhouette lurks in the shadows of all that happens. Ike returns to the temple and renounces the rights of rule to Dayan. Those rights are passed through the General Z, Zelgaius of Bagnion, and to the apostle herself. The Crimean army absorbs another troop from Bagnion, with its might increased marches on the Dayan Crimean border. It's the next goal. It's the Raven Bridge, a massive structure that connect, connects the two countries. Skiing. I don't know. I don't know that word. It's like a thread or a string. Wild. I'm looking it up right now. Skan. Skayan? Skayan. A tangled or complicated arrangement, state, or situation. 
also the word for a flock of wild geese or swans in flight in a V formation. Skein. Weird. Those are weird two meanings. I mean, maybe it's just because geese and swans have a lot of drama that you need to untangle. My lord Ike may have a moment. Of course, what is it? These soldiers say that tomorrow will be we'll be able to see the Great Bridge. Once we cross it, we'll be in Crimea. That's what I've been told. It feels like I've been away for many years. Crimea is the land where I was born and raised. I feel so removed. I feel now at this late juncture that I know almost nothing in my own country. It's an unreal experience. I know what you mean. I don't have the sense that we're on the brink of being back in Crimea either. I don't even remember this area at all. Maybe it's because I was born in Gallia and raised in the countryside. But the countries are all joined together like this all over the continent. I'm really in awe of it all. So am I. For when I knew nothing of the life outside the royal, royal villa, everything is so very big. Big. Yeah, I guess you're right. When we left Crimea, it was spring. The snows were melting, the days were getting longer, the weather was mild. It's been almost a year since we departed over a year, but the distance we've traveled to get here has been long and hard. It feels like many years have passed. Yet this is the land where I was born and raised. Oh, my dear sweet Crimea. How is it that you fell so far away? Feel so far away. For me too. Crimea is my homeland. We're almost there. Let's go home. It is as you say. Let's go home. Oh, what a romantic setting. Makes it hard to make an appearance. I guess I should just leave you to... Huh? I know that voice! Hey there, Ike. Looks like we stayed alive just long enough to be reunited. Aren't we the lucky ones? Renolf! My lord Renolf, it's good to see you again. My princess Silencia, welcome home. I'd curtsy, but the tale makes it look silly. What are you so darn chipper about? Once I heard the news that the Crimean army had taken the day in capital, I ran all this way to greet you. How go things in Gallia? You're not engaged in open hostilities with Dan, are you? Not yet. What's that supposed to mean? In light of your army's success, the elders have finally agreed on something. Gallia will lend its full support to the Princess Crimea's efforts to liberate her homeland. It's a done deal. Really? So this Gallian army is going to... We're going to establish communications with them and create a unified front. That being said, Gallia is here to support you. Crimean army will always be at the center of the effort. Don't forget that. They had to, like, put that line in because the previous army that we picked up with, they're like, oh, they're trying to take credit for everything going on. And then he's like, specifically, we are not here to take credit. <laughs> Support role only. King Galia is being most gracious. That posture will allow Crimea to lay claim to any victories we achieve. I gotta check the volume levels, because I was messing with it. Yeah, we're good. Don't say things like that. I'm shocked. You wouldn't understand such subtleties. Who are you, and what have you done with Ike? I don't believe you have the right to speak to me like that. Kidding. Actually, Soren just lectured me on the same situation when we received reinforcements with Ike Neon. Of course. We're tutored by your nervous little staff officer. Now I get it. Has he snapped yet? He seems high-strung. King K Kangas is always thinking of Crimea, isn't he? How can I ever repay him? Princess, let's win your country back. And then when that's done, please rebuild the bonds of friendship between our nations. That'd be the ultimate way to say thank you, wouldn't it? Yes, of course. Ike, report the results of the last battle. We got a good chunk of bonus XP. That's seven levels for somebody. There were no deaths, no injuries. Everything's going well. Okay, we're going to do the support stuff and uh, manage a little bit. Um, and do the chat so that we can come in strong tomorrow. Because I don't think we can do it. We have enough time to really do another chapter. But we will do uh, all the extra stuff. So we can just jump in next time. Uh, where is our thief?
Secret book increases the skill. Luck, defense, magic resistance. I guess we can. Ten or higher to upgrade class. We don't want to deal with that. Increases the user build. We have a million chest keys. Alright. Uh, we should get another fire in here. Oh. There we go. Easily done. Uh, East Preach of Lives gives me bonus XP. That's what I figured. Uh, that's why I wasn't like... We're one away from the bonus, but like... We still got a good chunk of, of a reward. It was like letting the... Um, uh, hawks flee from that one one battle. Uh, okay, what else do we need to do? I can probably give this chess key away. Oscar can probably give this chess key away. Board's good to go. Rolf's good to good to go. Yeah, Rolf's good to go. Katri. Can we just get a steel lance, like a fresh one? We're just gonna get a fresh one. Um, trying to figure out if we need any other stuff. Should we? Okay, I'm trying to think of, um, so we had some some extra people keeping some stuff alive. We could probably level up Gotri. What's that? 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. That's four levels to get Gotri up to uh, general status. This dude, Knight General. Um, I mean, Stefan's promoted up. It's free real estate. Yeah. <laughs> You can't not kill the priests. That's the thing. Um, Iron Bow still kicking for Kieran. Oh, we didn't use any of these people. I'm just trying to think if we need to do anything with them. I don't think so. Um, we should uh, give somebody something. I really don't like the armored units. Like, I know they're fi they're fine. They're fine. Um, maybe we should give Stefan a sword. I mean, he's already got this one. Weight is eight. I'm trying to figure out if, if we should give him like a light one or something, maybe. I'm kind of, like, thinking we should get Stefan in the mix a little more. Maybe? we just give him this. Crit sword. You can promote poor race. We could. But why? Poor, under-leveled. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, but but why would we do that? Here's the thing. Why would we do that? I'm just checking out who else we got going on here. A lot of people that we just, like, completely moved on from. Sage with a knife. 
which was the wrong choice. All right. I don't think anybody needs any gear. Let's, uh... Can we make a knife? We can't make a knife. That's a bummer. I guess we'll make a sword. Silver is more expensive, needs more better, right? Yeah, yeah. What? Uh, hey, 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 hey. We'll just spend 21,000 on this sword, with this one sword. You know what? 226. That's what we that's what we want. What if we what if we backed up? What if we did a steel one instead? Thirteen a hundred nine. So we get we get more options with the silver. time apparently the crit only goes up to nine we're gonna do crit three because apparently that is a reasonable amount of money to spend change the weapon name I, I don't know what to call this one I know exactly what to call this one. Hey, can I just move? Up? Yeah, there we go. Nope. This is the clunky. I feel terrible working on working with this. Okay. We need to delete. And then select. There we go. And we will, of course, make it pink. All right, we'll try to use Stefan a little more. Uh, support. We don't have any support stuff. Unless we do... Nope. Info. Soren's gonna give us a ton of info. Hmm. Soren, are you in there? Yes. Ike, it's late. What do you want? Shh. Uh, Ike? Oh no. How strange. I was sure he'd come this way. Yoo-hoo! That voice, is that the woman from the item shop? Isn't it? Commander Ike, where have you gone, handsome? Crud. Did you run in here to escape? Look, whenever that woman corners me, it takes forever to get her to go away. Just let me hide in here until things simmer down. We began marching tomorrow morning. This is a waste of valuable time. I'll go chase her away. Wait, Soren! Ike, Ikey Poo, where are you? <laughs> Amy. Oh, Soren. Ew. I mean, uh, hi. Uh, why are you out so late? Don't you have some, do you have some business with Ike? Well, yes, I do. I found a special something I'd like to give to him. Do you know where he is? Ike is in a war meeting. If you have something for him, I can hold on to it for you. Hmm. What should I do? You see, I have this new staff. Staff is very valuable. 
I'm not sure I feel comfortable just uh, handing it over to someone who doesn't, you know, understand that. That's a hammerine, is it not? A rare staff that can take any item, no matter how battered and worn, and repair it completely? Why, that's right. You're really knowledgeable, aren't you? If I may continue, I believe that there is only one of these in all the world. It's truly priceless. And you want to give it to Ike? Well, I do want to be helpful. If you truly wish to capture Ike's attention, bring him staffs and whatnot will avail you nothing. What? Really? Oh dear, I was hoping he would like it. Food, however, will be much more effective than a staff. He's particularly fond of spicy meat dishes. Is that so? Cooking's not something I'm skilled at, but... Ooh, I've got it. I know the perfect dish. Ah, good. He will be very pleased. Uh, what about that staff? You can keep it as payment for the cooking tip. Take good care of it. Well, she's unexpectedly generous. I'll receive something quite nice from uh, your admirer, Aiki Poo. Thank you so much. Hey, wait a minute. Send it to the convoy. I can now repair items. So I guess... God, what did we make first? I think we made Ike's sword, Sting. I think we made that first. Maybe it needs a repair. We'll take a look. We'll speak to Shinon. Understood. Proceed as order. Sir, yes, sir. What's next? Huh, who's there? Yes, uh, sir. Hey, General Ike the Great. I've heard all about it, you know? Those guys went and made you a noble. Shinon? Good for you, huh? Her, her. Thick. You're in love with a pretty little princess, and you're fighting side by side with your subhuman pals. Yeah, you're moving on up. Ooh, look at you, big Mr. Ike, leading the good life. The good life of, of constant war. <laughs> they're not subhumans, they're the goose. Y yeah, whatever. Here's the deal. Now that you're a high-class noble, you can't be running around with a bunch of broke mercenaries. All the other nobles are going to laugh at you, so, so give it up. I'll do you a favor and take over. Uh, I don't think so. I'm going to con continue as commander of Grail Mercenaries. Shinon, please. Screw you. You always get everything. Don't you ever want to give up anything? No, not big important Mr. Ike. You've always been like this. You act like you're not interested in something, and you swoop in and steal it away. Shinon. What? What? Watch how you say my name, boy. Boy, boy, little boy, Ike, little Ikey. Shinon, what's wrong with you? Are you feeling all right? What do you care, you snotty whelp? It's none of your business. And, an, and another thing about the command of the company. If you refuse to give it up, at least change the name. You're not Commander Grail just because you're his son. That doesn't give you the right to use his name. Shinar, are you sure you're alright? I'm fine, I'm fine, I'll be fine. I, uh, I don't feel so good. It was never about the commandership, it was about my father. Shinon, going through it. Um, alright. Let's, uh, I just want to check real quick. So, like, Ike's got a sword at 11, but, like, we're also just beating the crap out of the rest of his swords. Everybody else is, like, pretty good. Like, in the 20s? Like, like I was worried about Rolf's gun, but he's 27. We just made S words. Should we make uh, Astrid another sword, maybe? Eventually? We just made the Darksaber. Yeah, I don't know that we need to repair anything. Like,. Ike seldom uses his sword, and he's at 11, so I don't know. Whatever. It's fine. Okay. We're going to leave it there. 
Uh, we're going to pick up next week with uh, chapter 23. I am dying to get at that Black Knight. Dying for it. I can feel it. I can, I can, I can feel the revenge. It's, ha- it's going to happen. Uh, thanks for hanging out, watching uh, some Fire Emblem. I will see you next Sunday. <laughs>